Assalamu alaikum HD family, welcome back to the Halal Digest. It's been a long time since I've been this excited for a new Halal business to open up. And today we're checking out the Sweet Reserve in Lombard and I cannot wait to Halalify. HD family, this is a fully Halal sweet shop, bakery, cafe, whatever you want to call it. With lots of cool looking items, amazing decor, definitely a new business. I wanted to Halalify and support. HD family, we met the owner. We made dua for them, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help them in their business. And they let us know that they are working on getting Hafsa certification. So definitely be on the lookout for that. In the meantime, let's halalify this sweet reserve. So we got several items that look really tasty. We got a lot of them based on their recommendation as well. So they come in these beautiful looking boxes here. So sweet reserve, mashallah. All right, family, so let's open it up. Bismillah. There we go. All right, so we got a couple of cool items here. Let's open up this one as well. MashaAllah. So, okay, so let's start off with the easy ones. This is a Ras Malai Tres Leches. Looks really good. Recommended. This is, I think, this is also recommended, their Pistachio Tres Leches. Uh, we also got their Signature Chocolate. This one looked really good, also recommended. We got some sticky buns. This looks really good, mashallah. Suppose we got a couple of chocolate truffles, one with coconut, one with just chocolate. We got a couple of popsicles. I don't remember what the filling is. I think cookie butter. I think that's what it is. And finally, this beautiful looking uh, dessert right here. This is a some type of tart. I do not know what that is. I don't know the name of that tart, but it's looks great. RC family, this looks all amazing. The first thing I actually want to try is their popsicle. This is a cream popsicle here. This looks amazing, <laughs> mashallah. Really, really cute. Bismillah. First bite for our brothers and sisters in Lebanon. Bismillah. Alhamdulillah. Very decadent. This is uh, <laughs> really good, honestly. Alhamdulillah. Wasn't really expecting much. Um, I actually like... Um, cakesicles or popsicles whatever they're called this is the best one i've had to be honest these it is there's nothing overly sweet here which i really really appreciate the balance are very well flavored think of a sugar cookie batter uh that's not too sugary really really rich in flavor alhamdulillah i think you'll like this and i definitely recommend it but we'll see what uh, my top contenders are at the end of this so we'll put this away here and let's get started with some of the other items i'm really actually excited to try their chocolate tart this just looks phenomenal, mashallah. I'm really, really impressed with how this looks. So I'm really, really excited for this. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Bismillah. Mmm. Mm hmm This is really nice. So, you got a nice cookie uh, edge here. You got some fluffy tart I think um, it is like a raspberry type it's not too tart if, if you know what I mean it's not sour which uh, I think for most people I think for me personally I don't like that tartness um, I don't know what this is I have no clue what this oh this is raspberry uh, yeah I think that's what it is a raspberry tart nice and sweet and fresh alhamdulillah this is very nice definitely recommend it as well alhamdulillah again nothing here is overly sweet which I'm really Honestly, you got to give respect to that because when things are just too sweet, you can't even enjoy it. So, alhamdulillah, rabbil alamin. Really, really nice. Also, uh, I recommend it. RHD family, let's get to their truffles. So, this is a coconut truffle. Actually, let's try to try the chocolate one first. So, that way, it's probably the same, really. Bismillah. Alhamdulillah. Really nice. This is on the sweeter side, as expected. Uh, super, super moist. Very chocolatey. Alhamdulillah, these are, as expected, really rich, good quality chocolate truffles. One of the best I've tried, to be honest. And even though it's sweeter than the other uh, items we've had, it's not candy sweet. Again, gotta really appreciate that. It really, not it's not easy to have that much flavor and not to be sweet at the same time. All right, family, so the first cake jar uh, the Sweet Reserve uh, folks recommend was the Pistachio Trace Leches. So let's open that up. Bismillah. Ooh, mashallah. 
I like that. Actually, let's open it all up. This is the Ras Malai Tres Leches. Ooh, very beautiful. Mashallah. And finally, the signature chocolate. Mashallah, looks very beautiful. All right, see family, so we open them all. Let's check out their pistachio tres leches. Bismillah. Some cream on top. Bismillah. Mmm. Alhamdulillah. This is phenomenal. Actually, I have to, I have to stop myself from eating more because I got to try a few more of their items. This is really nice. So, if you know how tres leches is, it's... Um, it's milky, it's moist, and then there's, you know, that, 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 that pistachio twist. It's really nice, honestly. Alhamdulillah, definitely a must-try when you go to the Sweet Reserve Bakery. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, what a blessing. Bismillah. Next is a beautiful Ras Malai Tres Leches. So first time trying something like that with some edible flowers, I guess. Bismillah. All right. Bismillah. Again, it has the familiar uh, Tres Leches. And then you have that really extra milky flavor with the Ras Malai. Alhamdulillah, pretty enjoyable overall. Next Ishi family is their signature chocolate clap. Signature, yeah, their signature chocolate. Bismillah. Not sure what that topping is, but we'll see. So this one is not Tris Leche, so it's not going to be as milky and all that. But nice, beautiful layers, as you can see. Bismillah. So the cake is very moist. I think they. this is a... Cream cheese, cream cheese frosting. So, yeah, I'm a fan of the buttercream. I think, regardless, if you like a chocolate cake, um, I think definitely it's worth a try as well. Out of the several cake jars I've had, and they have like more, the pistachio one is uh, definitely something that I recommend. Out of all the ones we've tried so far, finally, HD family is their pecan sticky bun. So they recommended to heat it up, so let's do that. All right, HD family, so I put this in the microwave for 10 seconds. It's pretty warm from the bottom. Let's check out the pistachio, <laughs> their pecan sticky bun. Bismillah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So imagine the perfect Cinnabon with pistachio, and then ooey gooey caramel on the outside. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. This is one of the best. This is definitely a must try for sure at the Sweet Reserve. Bismillah. Phenomenal. Phenomenal. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Really, really impressed with the Sweet Reserve Bakery. They are definitely halalified. They have just so many options. They're going to have more cafe items like sandwiches and things like that. But in the meantime, their desserts are amazing. Based on what I've got, there's probably other amazing items they have. But based on what I've got, if I had to narrow down to two items, I would go with their pistachio tris leches cake and their pecan sticky buns. If you really want, you can go for their cakesicle, which we got the buttercream flavor, which was excellent. Alhamdulillah, but otherwise, all their items were really, really nice. Uh, so definitely, definitely recommend it. Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala rasulullah. I want to thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for all these blessings. I want to thank the HT family for supporting the channel. As always, we encourage what is good. We stand up against injustice and oppression. We are with our brothers and sisters in Al-Aqsa, in Sheikh Jarrah, in Palestine, in Lebanon, in Syria, in Jordan, in Turkey, in Egypt, in Yemen, in Iraq, in Afghanistan, in Pakistan, in India. Our Rohingya and Uyghur brothers and sisters, our Kashmiri brothers and sisters, our brothers and sisters in Sudan, in Somalia, in Algeria, in Morocco, in Libya, in Indonesia, in Malaysia, in Thailand, in Singapore, in Korea, in Vietnam here in America and all of North America, in South America, in Asia, in Europe, in Australia, in Africa, and everywhere where Allah and His Messenger are raised and praised. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to be a benefit to all of humanity based on the sunnah of our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And with that, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Peace be to you all.